Hey everybody, welcome back for another review. And today we have a Tuesday Mullum. This is the collaboration beer between Unibrew Brewing and the heavy metal band Megadeth. Um, totally admit, I picked this up just because this is a collaboration from uh, Megadeth. Um, Unibrew, I really don't drink a lot of their stuff much anymore. They come out with so many different, uh, you know, different beers and stuff over the past couple years that a lot of them I really didn't appreciate and um, I really haven't uh, drank a lot of their stuff lately. But um, this is a Belgium style Saison uh, coming in at 4.5%. Um, did the pour and nice golden copper tan with a, it had a monster foamy um, white, really, really sticky foamy uh, lacing going on. Um, the head was a good two, two and a half inches. Um, aroma wise, I had lots of white grape, um, some coriander, lemon peel, um, a little breading malt in there, some pepper, a little funky note, very farmhouse, um, it's a, you know, standard saison, some cherry, apple, it smells really, really good. Um, there's a lot of aroma coming out of this, so I was worried at 4.5% this would be um, a very muted version, but um, the aroma is really, really good. Let's have a sip. Okay, um, it starts off really, really um, tart and soured, um, and then uh, some like apple and cherry, some spices come in. Um, it finishes a little thin, a little weak. Um, really, nothing left on the palate. It just kind of the sour, funky up front, and then it finishes real, real thin, almost watery. Um, and have another sip. Some bready, um, some bready uh, uh, malt, some little funky yeast mixed in there. Um, yeah, I'm surprised at how thin it finishes. There's virtually no aftertaste to this at all. Um, there's a decent amount of like funkiness and uh, sour tart note to it. Um, cherry, and apple, white grape. Um, for four and a half percent, you know, I expect it to be a little light, a little easy drinking, but there is a decent amount of flavor to this. This is actually, I should, this is pretty nicely done for being um, a Belgium style Saison. Um, it's quite nice, very, very drinkable. So yeah, after a couple of drinks, the mouth gets more accustomed to the tartness. It's not overwhelming as the first sip. Um, um, ratings wise, I'll, um, I'll give this a, a 90. I'll give this a solid B plus. Um, you know, four and a half percent. It drinks really easy. Um, it's pretty decent balance to it. The mouth feels thin, and the finish is very thin. And um, but it's four and a half percent, so it's supposed to be way more sessionable. Um, it's a pretty nice job. Um, there's, uh, you know, there's absolutely nothing wrong with this. Um, it's a nice change up from a lot of the hoppy beers I drink and stouts and whatnot. Um, yeah, this is nicely done. This is very respectful, and um, I'm sure uh, I'm sure that uh, you know Dave has this, and he's very satisfied with it. Um, it's a nice beer. Uh, this is uh, Unibrews, a Tout de Mon, four and a half percent Belgium style saison. I gave it a ninety, a B plus. Um, it's there's nothing new. It's not mind blowing or nothing, but it's very smooth and easy to drink, and it has plenty enough flavor for being such a low alcohol beer. I recommend picking up a bottle and giving it a shot. Um, it's definitely worth a drink. It wraps it up, guys. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. See you in the next review. Thanks.